First, two Edmonds High School students accused of making racial threats are scheduled to appear in juvenile court tomorrow morning. King 5's Natalie Swaby joins us with the latest on the investigation and reaction from the community. Inside this neighborhood spot, the focus is good cuts and conversation. I kind of got disturbed by this news. But tonight's topic tugs at Ada Alfalabi's heart. It is very powerful and uh, it's, uh, it's unacceptable, you know, especially for this uh, neighborhood, for Edmonds. From the barber to the concerned customer. That's dangerous. Huh. Like 15 and 16 years old kids, you know, thinking like that, that's too much. To the shock student. That happened where I live, where I go to school, and so it was just a big eye-opener for me. It's a crime that feels too close. Yeah, it's a couple blocks away. Blocks away at Edmonds Woodway High. Just as classes were letting out today, a letter was sent home about a school threat made over social media targeting African-American students. Police say since August, Two male students ran an online chat room and included detailed descriptions about how they intended to kill classmates, including lynching one of the victims. I don't know. It, it's very sad. It's really sad. Back at the barber shop, it's a lot to take in. I just feel empathy towards those um, African American classmates of theirs who like have been threatened. Here, it's more than just haircuts. There are strong community connections. This is our neighborhood, you know. I've been here working 13 years. That's why he cares about what happens outside his front door. It's the reason today was so tough. No, it makes me worried now, you know. According to police, the students did make the comments but denied any intention of carrying out the threats, saying they were trying to be funny. They were booked into a juvenile detention center for the crime of malicious harassment. In Edmonds, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News. Two Edmonds students accused of making violent threats on social media now face felony charges. Today, a judge set bail at $10,000 for each teenager. The boys' fathers both said their sons did something stupid but did not mean harm. The 15 and 16-year-old are accused of threatening the entire student body at Edmonds Woodway High School in addition to specific black students on Facebook. These are extremely serious allegations which raise profound public safety concerns. Police say the teenagers admitted making the comments, but denied any intention of carrying out the threats.